Wilson Morales from Black Femin TV. Makai, how's it going? Wilson, I'm feeling great, man. How are you? Good. So you've got the biggest task of them all, leading the charge as you play young Kanan. You know, how did this come about for you? Was it a big audition and you won out over a thousand people like they always do with these type of roles? <laughs> man, honestly, you would, I feel like you'd have to talk a little more to Sasha and, and 50 to like really see the numbers of that. I know for me, um, you know, I, I've auditioned a total of three times, but in all three of those auditions, we just went through a bunch of different, you know, just options. And, you know, they throw, they throw random scenarios at me just to see, you know, how I adjust that into the scene. And um, so, yeah, you know, leading up to it, um, I, I didn't know I was auditioning for Raising Kane and I knew it was power, which I was excited about because I'm a fan of power, you know? So that's all I really cared about at that moment. Um, so I auditioned and it was, it wasn't until my last audition that I knew I was auditioning for Raising Canaan and I was playing Canaan and I was like, oh, that's, wow, that's, that's wild. And that, that flown me out to New York. Uh, that's where I met Patina Miller, who plays my mother. Oh, she's incredible. Um, and we kind of just hit it off from, you know, that, that, uh, that chemistry read. And that's where they kind of made their, you know, final decision that we were locked in. And, uh, that, that was that whole thing. <laughs> And how does it feel for you as an actor, you know, actors who are young, like yourself, you know, are happy to get aside, you know, say when you, when you do a project, whether it be a TV or a film, but here, you're practically almost, almost on every page, you know, and you're at, interacting with a lot of the actors and characters mm -hmm. on this show. What does that do for you? Is it a challenge knowing that you have to read so many lines over and over again? Or is this, uh, are you developing your skills or you just kind of go with it as it goes along? Um, honestly, you know, I feel like this is kind of a position I've wanted to be in for a long time. Um, you know, I've been very blessed and fortunate to, you know, find myself in, in so many other situations where I, I have had prominent roles, but, you know, finding, finding yourself in this sort of situation as an actor, it is a challenge, but that's the sort of thing I was looking for. You know, I love challenges and, and this has been no exception to that on all fronts, you know, it's been, it's been a challenge in terms of, you know, the actual workload. It's been a challenge in terms of, you know, just actual processes and techniques you have to use. Um, it's been a process in terms of actual, you know, time and effort put in. But, you know, these are, these are things I feel like I've been working and adjusting and, and tweaking for years to get to this place, to continue to work and ju adjust and, and tweak, you know, as, I, as my career grows. And there's working with 50. You know, I, I like to say that oh, yeah. power is almost like a comic book in which everybody knows these characters. You got to know everything about the show and mm -hmm. all the other shows. You know, mm -hmm. like people are going to be quizzing you. Like, you don't know what happened to Kanan in episode three? Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah. so it's sort of like... But so see, but see that's the actually kind of, that's the dope part, I think. And what I'm, I'm really excited for with Raising Kanan, you don't have to, you know, it's not one of the comic book things where you have to have prior knowledge of the show or prior knowledge of the characters to really understand what's going on. If anything, this kind of could serve as a precursor to the, you know, the, the, the power universe. Cause technically chronologically, um, this is the, the first installment, you know, we're in 1991, the rest of the power universe has been, you know, from what, what was it 2012, 2013 to now or whatever. Um, so, you know, that's, that's one of the things that I've been really excited for people to see is it's, it's an entirely different world with entirely different characters. Um, it just happens to be in the same universe with some of the same sort of platforms and, uh, and uh, structures. Mm -hmm. So with the exception of you and Jukebox, well, at least we know you're going to make it out to the end. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so uh -huh. keep that Absolutely. going. It's good to see you on screen. We'll be happy to see you week after week. Congratulations. Thank I'll talk so to you much. down the road. Oh, yes. <laughs> Love.